Today I'm gonna to show you guys how to set, it. so whenever you use the type tool, um, you're always gonna be using a default font. Um, mine is Tahoma, I just can't stand Tahoma. So I use Didio, um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to set, it. so whenever you use the type tool, it's always gonna be set whatever font you want. I'm on my uh, project right now, so let's say I wanna put some text uh, right here. For the caption, let's just say, like working on setting up gimbal. Okay, um, so yeah, this is how it's set right now. So I'm just working on setting up my gimbal. Um, but I just can't stand that font. It looks terrible. So what you want to do is up on the tabs here, you want to set it so you're on graphics. Okay, so then you click on, you click on the text that you just put in. Okay, click on the text you just put in on the actual graphics text right here. Uh, below this, you want to set the text that you want. Uh, I want Didio. Okay. So if I change the text right here, uh, this is not going to change the master text. This is not going to change the text whenever I use the type tool. It's always going to be a Tahoma. Um, we want to set it so there's a master style. So you go on here, you create master text style. So for this, I'm just going to say Vexor1. Uh, hit OK. And now, whenever you use the type tool, it's always going to be at the at the uh, font that you put in for that master text. So let's just say like taking forever. It takes a long time to set up the gimbal. So that's kind of how it works. Now the problem with this is is uh, whenever you're working on the project from here on out, like when you're still on the application, it's going to be set to whatever you, whatever font you put it at. Let's say like you you save it, you go out, you quit it. That text, the master text you just put in, still like you can't set it, so it's always like the default text is always whatever you set it to. It's gonna be whatever Adobe sets it up to be. Yeah, if I use the type tool again, and just say work in whatever, default font is back at Tahoma. Now like something you can do to change it like right away since you're gonna already have a master style in here, you just go to master styles, you click down here, and then you click on whatever master style that you set the uh, font to initially. So still, uh, it's not like a complete solution, but before I would just have to change the font every single time. And I feel like this is a big problem that people run into and there just simply isn't a good tutorial for it. So that's why I was trying to make a tutorial for it here to try to solve those issues for some people. Um, but yeah, other than that, uh, that's about it, you guys. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.